Ross, taking in the Adidas Nations Championship game, how is it now to be on the other side of this and watching these guys play? Oh, it's a great opportunity. I mean, uh, being having this, being in these shoes at this at uh, this moment with these guys. And I mean, uh, it was just a really good experience that I had with this, and I hope the guys are really learning from it. And uh, just happy to come here and support all these young guys right now. How much did you benefit from this, and what did you take away from it the most when you participated? Oh, I benefited a lot. I mean, you could look at the coaches. I mean, the coaches are all high-level guys who've been in the NBA and coached in the NBA. And uh, just be able to take what those guys say and absorb it. And, and the, the competition that you're playing is second to none. So just going in there really helps you your skills as a basketball player and your knowledge for the game also. And now, you and your UCLA teammates, none of y'all were college counselors because you're, per you're practicing getting ready for a tournament in China. How is practice going so far? Well, practice is going really well. I mean, we're looking really good as a team. Uh, Coach Holland is, is making sure he stresses us to run and get up and down the floor and uh, with the freshmen we have and the guys coming back this year, really good squad this year. Coach Howland is regarded as one of the most demanding coaches. What's the transition been like now that you're playing for him? Oh, it's been great. I mean, uh, just learning how to how to uh, work harder on defense and uh, always staying in a, in a bit position and uh, that's, that's pretty much it and just learning from that and learning from the guys who've been there and, and uh, everything's been solid. Well, experience is always valued in college basketball, but last year Kentucky, a freshman laden team, won the national championship. Are you guys going to the next season feeling like you can do the same thing? Oh, absolutely. We're going in thinking uh, we, we can do that. I mean, the guys we have, uh, Kentucky had a whole bunch of sophomores and freshmen, and that's what we have this year uh, with our with our guys, with Josh Smith and, uh, and Tyler Lamb and, and us four freshmen and uh, the Ware Twins. I mean, we have a lot of good pieces, and uh, if we just add all of them up, uh, we'll be a really good team. What kind of role has Coach Howland told you that he's expecting you to play next year? Yeah, he's expecting me to be a leader on the floor. I mean, uh, uh, trying to transition my hard work into practice and making everybody else want to work and uh, and be the next guy and then when we go out there and play we're going to be a really good team. When the talk of the 2013 draft comes up you're almost always mentioned as a potential number one or number two pick no lower than three. How hard is it to kind of close out that hype and just focus on the season? Oh I mean it's hard but I mean uh, you got to look at it as a uh, you put yourself in this position so I'm just going to keep continuing to work hard and, uh, and see what the outcome comes from me. Are you thinking at all about the 2013 draft? Are you expecting to be one done? Uh, not expected to be one done right now. I mean, uh, I want to get this college season started and, uh, and try to make our way to Atlanta.